there is good in this world, and she was a great example of that. They never met Kelsey Barrett in person, but her story... She's going to be one that's going to stick with me for a long time. Her story sticks with the people who work to solve her murder. It's hard to tell a parent, it's hard to tell a loved one that they're you know, child, their daughter, their husband, their son, their, you know, whatever has been been murdered. Um, but to tell them how this happened was, that was a, like, I, I didn't know how the heck to do it. Now that the trial is really over, now that people and, were held you know, accountable, told two told investigators told are ready to was. share their thoughts on this case. The, the biggest reason I wanted to do any of the interviews is just so Kelsey's not forgotten and overlooked. Chris Adams, former Woodland Park Police Commander, now a CBI agent, and Greg Slater, a CBI agent too. It's been a long year for you guys. You take the weight of all of this to help to make sure that Kelsey's remembered. They believe Kelsey's story often got lost within the story of her killer, the father of her child, Patrick Frazee, who beat her to death with a baseball bat, and the woman who helped him clean up the crime scene and burn Kelsey's body. Crystal Lee, whose plea deal gave investigators critical information. I know you've seen some wild things in your career. I'm just curious what your initial reaction was when you got her full story. When I, it was really, I, I had to take a second. It's, it's hard to understand what Crystal did and why she did it. I was dumbfounded and mm -hmm. I didn't know how to digest it. It, it, it took, took a couple days for it to, to really sink in and the gravity of the situation. And She's an intelligent woman. Um, she is a good mom. The decisions that she made and why, I, I, I will never understand. And quite frankly, I'm not sure um, any of us will ever understand. But without Crystal, we wouldn't be where we, we are today. Today, Patrick Frazee is behind bars, serving a life sentence for his crimes. Crystal testified at his trial. With her plea deal, she got a three-year sentence. It's, it's a bittersweet victory because unfortunately, Kelsey's not here. I think we have a pretty good picture of, of, of things, but I think there's things that are missing. What, what are those things? I don't know. I, I, I really don't know. Is there anything else about this that still unsettles you or that just like you wish you could still answer? Why? I'd like to know why Patrick chose to do this. Why Crystal went through with what she did. Why Patrick didn't just walk away. There were times it's like, man, I just would go off on my my own, you know, and just just try to try to make sense of it all, but you can't. I was you just can't make sense of it. What they can do is shift the focus away from the crime and the people involved and back to the woman who lost her life. Neither one of us want people ever to lose sight of Kelsey. Mm -hmm. Because this is really what it's about is Kelsey. Kelsey Barrett. She was and still is important and always will be.